Voice your vote. Election day just hours away and thousands of you have voted early. It's still though expected to be busy at polls across the state. Nicole Gregg shows us the security measures to protect poll workers and you. The security upgrades out here are visible. The latest ones you can see these orange and white barricades that line the sidewalk outside the tabulation headquarters as well as across the street. We believe that these are here to keep people on the sidewalks if protests happen tomorrow night. Top election in Maricopa County officials trying to make clear with Arizona voters on what they can expect Tuesday. They wanted to go over misinformation so voters aren't misled. Arizona and really Maricopa County is at the center of the universe in terms of the democracy, the democratic process that makes this country so beautiful. The first thing they want to make clear is that under state law, we will not have final results on election night. That's because it takes several days to have all the votes counted, especially those early ballots dropped off on election day. We're not going to know in some of these races. We may not know who the winners are on election night. We may not know for several days. Also raising concern is misinformation that election workers change people's votes. Supervisor Bill Gates says there's an entire audit process if needed. The tabulation machine cannot read a contest for some reason. That contest then is reviewed by a bipartisan team. Maricopa County Sheriff Paul Penzone says they are preparing every way possible. I asked him if he's expecting protests outside election headquarters. This is the absolute unequivocal priority for the time being and all necessary resources will be dedicated to ensure the safety of the, the, the facility and the people therein. As for the Justice Department, Arizona is one of the 24 states they will have poll watchers, something election officials say is not new. We've had conversations, there will be several of them just going out to make sure that our voting operations are smooth, that we're not violating any, violating any voters' rights as they're participating in the process. One thing we have heard from election officials, concerns about long waits tomorrow on election day. Election officials say that if you are at a polling location and the line is long, they say online they have a list of all the wait times at every location. So let's say one line says it's an hour. They say down the road may only be 15 minutes. So they're trying to make it easy for voters on election day. Reporting in downtown Phoenix, Nicole Grigg for ABC 15 Arizona.